What's up, Franklin? Welcome to the Franklin Feed. Let's, Let's see what's, what's going around Franklin. Today's weather is cloudy. What high? 27. Welcome to the wonderful world of art. Today we have Maui. What inspired you to do your art? I just went to musicals and I love the waterfall so and I also love painting so I just uh, went home and painted the picture that I took. So why do you love painting? Because it inspires me a lot when I see other people paint and um, I just think it's a really nice hobby to have. So. That's it. Thanks for joining us. See you next time. Good morning, Franklin. Um, we are happy to be here with some of our all-city wrestling champions. Just want to let you know who they are, and if you see them around the building, give them a high five, congratulate them on their hard work. So we have in order, they've got their medals on for being city champs, that's awesome. So we've got Malachi Burnham as the 75 pound champion. Wave, Malachi. <laughs> Nathan Hewitt was our 85 pound champion. Matthew Hewitt was our 95 pound champion. Um, Trigger Heron was the JV 95 pound champion. Good job. Shalise Ely was our uh, 105 pound girls champion. Aiden Hernandez was the 126 pound champion. And Cooper Sorensen was the 165 pound champion. So congratulations to you guys for all of your hard work during the season and, and your championship at the All City Meet. Awesome. Um, again, if you see them in the hallway, give them high fives and tell them congratulations. and. Uh, and because it really is hard work to do well at wrestling, so uh, give them give them some kudos. One one other quick announcement. Um, we'll get you more information about this, but I want you to start thinking about it now. We have made some arrangements and had some outside help to make uh, two ski trips possible this year. Before we had said there was no ski trip at all, but we've got it figured out where we can now do two of them. Um, they will be on the first and the eighth of February. Um, if you want to go, you will have to commit to both of them. Um, just like I said, we'll get you more detailed information later. The total cost, if you need to rent equipment, will be $111 for the two days combined. That's for both days total. Um, if you have your own equipment, it would be $71. So um, we're going to open it up in the next couple days as soon as we get the forms ready to go to 7th and 8th graders and uh, we can take 200 learners to, on the ski trip. So if you are interested, for the first three or four days, we'll just do seventh and eighth graders. And then if we don't get 200 of you, seventh and eighth graders, then we'll open up to sixth graders at that point. But uh, we, it's awesome. It's not, we aren't gonna do any of this, the night trips. We tried to get those put in. We, we weren't able to do that. But we will be, um, we will be, uh, doing those two trips on February 1st and February 8th with uh, the oh, 200 of you going up that you'll get, you'll be required to take a lesson even if you're an advanced skier, they'll give you an advanced uh, instructor and and then you'll be able to ski the whole mountain the rest of the day um, until 2.30 and then we'll load the buses and come back to school. So 200 of you, it'll be $111 with with rental and or $71 if you have your own equipment. So again, we'll get you more details, but super exciting uh, opportunity. So start thinking about it, February 1st and February 8th if you're able to go. Thank you and have a fantastic day. Today for lunch is, in the fast food line, there's a breaded chicken burger. And in the main and deli, there's a pasta bar. Don't forget your fruits and vegetables. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye.